everybody. This is Teresa from Alabama. I am actually trying to figure out why Cash App has banded my account. Now, I've had this account for, I know, for at least two, probably three years. And basically, the only thing that I do is either transfer money out of my checking account, go do my state selling stuff, state finding stuff, go maybe every once in a while, send my grandkids some money, pay a couple of like red box if I want to do red box or whatever. So I'm just trying to figure out what did this gammy, what did this grandmother of 66 do to violate their terms and conditions? One day I'm at McDonald's getting my, you know, Diet Coke. Next day, my account is closed. No reason whatsoever, except that I have violated their terms and conditions. So, in the meantime, this has been going on um, probably now it's going on 20 days. So, I went ahead and I emailed them. And with the chat box, which is probably not a human, uh, even though they say their name is, you know, Tom, Dick, or Harry, whatever the name they come up with, uh, uh, is telling me that uh, it was closed because of the terms and conditions. And I said, well, I need to know exactly what I did to warrant my account to be closed. So, went back and forth with them with that and... Um, said I would get an email. He said, be sure to check spam. So I checked spam. You know, I've been checking spam, been thinking about it. And then the more I thought about it, the more it kind of pissed me off uh, for no reason out of the blue. I mean, if you're going to ban somebody from using something, don't to be so blank. It's just say terms and conditions or, or you're not, you violated that. And not give them an exact reason why. Did, uh, what they did. So basically, I cannot see. It's not like I, you know, use that as my checking account or use that to deposit money in, except from my checking account when I'm going out shopping stuff, uh, to see why I have never been denied credit whatsoever. And this isn't even credit. Uh, you use your own checking account to put the money in. Um, so. I've uh, even tried to Google it, and it says to be patient, you know, that um, they will uh, send you an email, and you may have to jump through hoops as far as giving them your driver's license, your security card number, your, you know, all this stuff for them to resolve it. And I'm thinking, what? What is it? I mean, life's too stressful as it is to even have to worry about that crap. But you not you kind of want to know, like, you know, what did you do wrong? You know, besides what it says you can do with the card. So, uh, it was, a, I, just, I don't get it. So, it's been, you know, like I said, tomorrow will be 20 days since I've emailed them. So, uh, I mean, uh, chatted with them and been waiting for that email and have yet not got that email back yet. I haven't got, got any reply whatsoever. And then I emailed them again. I said, well, how long does it take to see why y'all, uh, you know, closed my account? I mean, it's, you know, be fairly simple. I would think that you would know why you closed an account, you know, but everything's so electronic now. I mean, you don't even know if you're talking to a human. I mean, you can't get a human on the phone. Uh, you can only uh, go through uh, emailing them unless one of y'all, you know, know who I can actually call and talk to somebody about. I mean, if you are, put it in the comments. But um, I will update y'all about it. But I am just at a loss as to why uh, this 66-year-old grandmother of two who basically gives their grandkids money or pays for a red box movie or yeah i mean you know just random little things that you would might not want to use your regular uh debit card for 
uh, would get banned from using Cash App. My son, years ago, got me into Cash App because he said, oh, that's a great app. This is great. You know, they can't uh, trace your account, you know, if your card gets lost or whatever. I thought, well, that's pretty good, you know. And used it for years, no problem. Doing the same stuff that I'm doing now, I did at the time. Unless, hmm, let's think here. Now, I know that I used the boost for the McDonald discount twice in one week. Could that have been it? Could I have, but I don't know. I just don't know. And I really wish Cash App to warrant the card and the account to be closed. So put any comments in the down there and uh, like and subscribe. Hit the like button. If you don't like it, hit the unlike button or whatever. Uh, but um, I'm just wondering if anybody else has gone through this. And if they did, how long does it take just to get the email? Yeah, yeah, with the explanation as far as what happened. Yeah, if y'all know, let me know. And I'll keep y'all updated as soon as I can find out. Y'all have a good day.